Hello. I did not hit her. It's not true. It's bullshit. I did not hit her. I did not. Oh, hi, Mark. Hey, man, what's up? Not much. No. Uh, I forget. Okay, so, uh, Russell is late, so welcome to the second community meeting, everyone. Everyone, I have everyone, no idea what we're supposed there. to do. What's, what's Russell coming in? Saying? We're gonna shape uh, the Simply explains. if anyone has any questions, shoot them, otherwise we're all just gonna talk shit, I suppose. Yeah. I'm just talking about the server and stuff. What is your status on the insurrectionist? I mean, your uh, opinion. Fuck them. It's, the in oh, you're you're just memeing, right? Uh huh. UNSC forever, fucker. UNSC dogs will be stuck with our bayonets. It will be nuked. I doubt uh, you even I guess he bayonets. doesn't deny you the war crimes. Your fucking chain guns for even a second. I'm so sorry, Dave. but do you get uh, static emplacements? What the fuck? What the fuck did I do? I didn't do anything. So what well, I'm hearing is people this. think turrets are unbalanced. <laughs> Oh, no, I personally fun. hate them. I personally uh, I absolutely hate them. Because they kill more, like, allies, but, and they uh, kill uh, Flood. Can you give, <laughs> uh, can you give you, uh, ODST's C4 to combat the turrets? So, so can... um, ODST Wait. armor has been buffed to fix it. Uh, turns out it was worse than the marine armor, because somebody forgot to change a number, so. Sounds uh, about so... right. Yeah, yeah, soon that should be live on the server, and you guys might have a chance. I think I just recommend that the that code emplacements are a little become a little bit more important, and that ODSTs get C four to compensate for it. Uh, C four is a bad idea on the map we normally run on. Last time I checked, because it could blow a hold of base. Oh yeah, that's a good point. Any way to combat the issue without blowing open holes into space? Uh, I believe somebody was going to give the ODSTs flashbangs, so... Ooh, flashbangs, I like that. FLASHBANGS THROUGH THE DOOR! Remember, switching to your sidearm is faster than reloading. <laughs> well, no, no, my name is so Is that true, though? Mission fail, we'll give him next arm. Is that true, though? Switching to sidearms is faster than reloading. If you're American, yeah. Usually you have like is, yeah. 15 sidearms. No, 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 no. no. You, you, take a, you take the magazine out of the gun and then grab a different gun and load the magazine. <laughs> uh, you don't even need magazines. You just get, need one bullet for every single gun you have. And you just, take, like you just grab the bullet. Guns. You just grab the bullet every time it unloads. And then put it the bullet in. with a hammer. But, yeah, it, it actually takes double the amount of time to reload than it is to pull out a pistol. Russell smells. Well, then, yep. uh, just carry 15 pistols. Okay, it's faster than reloading. <laughs> uh, Buff some of these. 30 cool. damage each pellet. Drum right, mag, cool. uh, AK pistols, 15 so of them. So when Russell comes back in, we're all just gonna shame him. Just yell shame it. Alright, I got no, you. Uh, my son. Smells. Because you smell. smell. Thank Stick. you. That hurt my feelings. Sitik. 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 I'm gonna have to complain about you and UNSC barracks now. <laughs> Do it. Another complaint I've had about the Gadling guns is that some of the players are upset that people can just pick them off their uh, stand. Can't you dual well, wield them? Can't you do uh, that in we'll the games? Do. Couldn't think... you do that in the games? Like the Spartans can like take it off the stand. No, only Spartans and ODSTs, I believe. I don't think no, in ODST that was just something they didn't want to move, remove, and they went, eh, fuck it, left it in there. 
Yeah, unfortunately, the person who did that bit of code is not currently in the voice chat, so uh, you'll have to ask them later. The lower implications. It's seriously, like, it's specifically stated, if you go and look on the actual wiki, that no, ODSTs can't pick up the chain guns. They just left it in there. Yeah, I think that's planned okay, to be fixed, yes. but I don't know. You'd have to ask uh, XO next time he's on. Also, can we make new blood non-cannon? Uh, uh, exercise. Is that one of the Halo books? It's made hey, by 343. Lore person oh, yeah, that's in I this chat. Answer. For three books. Robot. Uh, yeah. 3264. Answer. Greetings. Can we make that book non-cannon? Would it cause problems? Why are we animals? I'll show you non-cannon here in a minute. Isn't it a new one? One with like the nanobot Spartans. Russell, Nobody. Russell is here. Wowie. Get to fucking. Who is this? Who are you? Now, what's new blood? A bad book. Um, so, is it set after Halo 1? Entirely. Yeah, no, it's we three, don't have to worry about it, we're fine. It's 343, three, ban. Yo, when are you adding oh, the wow. uh, Spartan Mark 7s? What is that? What game is that? It's the oh, Fadden wow. wiki. Somebody just linked it. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even know there was fucking Mark 7s. All I've this new shit is, is, is looks like a damn right. Terminator. Guys, what kind of thing master Every trait? Spartan would be using Mark 4, and Mark I 4 want. doesn't actually have that many customizations. Prepare, that, prepare for disappointment in that regard. When are we adding Muscle Master Chief? I want that. The, the <laughs> I want to be Master Chief. I want to be Mobile 6. Guys, I, want be, I, want I just want to point six. out. That Mark 7 article somebody just linked has uh, no, zero sources. I want to be Noble Squad, the whole squad. The whole squad. All the... What are you doing? Are you going to take um, Carter's head, Cat's torso, George's leg, and Mill's arm? One leg. Only... One leg. One leg, one arm. That's all I need. Yeah. How can they even get the image leg. for it if it doesn't exist? George left. Your legs is where your arm is supposed to be, and your arm is where your legs supposed to be. You're an abomination. The fuck, why? No, you. Oh, me. Halo. One of you and me. The other Halo wiki has more information on Mark Seven. Get a fucking head headset, say psychic. I do. It's just this laptop doesn't have enough connections. What do you mean? Do you, are you using a headphone right now? Uh, yeah. I have no. I have no other choice, man. I need to wait until a few days. I got beats. Yeah, same here. I have one port for the headphones. The microphone uses the exact same connector. Yeah, same. It's fucking hell. All right, I dragged it closer. Okay, so any complaints about anything other than the turrets or insurrection game mode? God damn it. Other, other, uh, other jackal species win. Give the sword buffs. Sword? No. Hunters win. When, when are scarabs? <laughs> when are hunters being added? When are scarabs being added? What can I, when can I have the scarab gun? Approximately five years of valve time. Well, I personally dislike the idea that whenever the ODST ha has a limited amount of time to be able to deploy, so now I have to deal with players constantly asking me to personally eject them into the field. Uh, it's either that or just let them roam around in the thing until they commit suicide. That's problematic. Can we just have a single spawn like of pods? Can you make it where... You exit the pod, like, you know, the launch pod, on Insurrection. Like, can you make it, like, 
you walk out just by uh, hitting the arrow keys, like moving. Instead of like right clicking, then exit. Or have it so that you buckle into it and can resist out of it instead. When are you going to add that. weapon attachments? Unga dunga. Okay, uh, repods, I am not sure. Yet again, the person that coded those is not in this chat at the moment. <laughs> well, what are you going to add? Uh, requisitions? And the command? Uh... Um... If anything, that's probably going to be once we start getting the uh, ship-based game modes done. How's the hostage game mode, uh, Black? Uh, it's coming along. I finally got the uh, map I need, so soon. I'm sorry. PM. <laughs> oh, uh, Kale wants some feedback on Crash Site Zeta. Talk about it. Right now, or you're all going to die. That's so, uh, the latest... We've had some uh, complaints that people aren't playing enough on the map, and some people think it's because the map's terrible, so any complaints? Lighting. What about Far Isle? Far Isle? It, it does have some pretty severe lighting issues. I dislike the lighting so fucking much. It, it really just makes everything Vision. ugly, it really makes everything unfunctional, like if you have like uh, if you built like fortifications and they got destroyed you can't tell whether or not they're destroyed you're going to be attacked by an invisible enemy if they're in there and it's just there should be dark spots yes but the entire map shouldn't be dark spots in, like with a few light spots that just leads people walking into the light spots that they need to go through getting shot by ninjas in the darkness and then them dying <laughs> Why the fuck do you have unsimilated turfs? The best way to deal with the problem is to literally just shoot into every dark spot to wait for the bullets to actually light up the area. So you can see someone in that spot. Well then you should have put it into actual map, you should have made a copy and then test it on that. So basically you're saying the best solution to all your problems is shooting them. Yes. <laughs> I'll get the I'll get my forty five caliber my dad has. So overall is that's that's my only problem with the map. I otherwise like the map. Okay, so does that apply to Crash Site Zeta as well as Far Isle or I don't know, you tell me, does it apply to Crash Site Zeta? We literally talk just all about that. <laughs> I think. I don't know. Somebody started talking and then said that that's why I hate Far Isle, so. I didn't hear nobody say anything about Far Isle. I said something about Far Isle. And then, uh, we'll talk about Crash Site Zeta. Okay, so lighting seems to be the problem for all those maps. Um,. For Far Isle, has anybody been getting a lot of lag on that map? Yes. It's only yes. when it's only just after the launch. It's weird in that it's not during the launch, it's just after it. I think it just like it's just so big that it takes such a long time to load. It doesn't load it like <coughs> when you land, it loads Hey, like, it's Russell. You gone. Russell so, smells he smells real bad. You're late. Shame. Shame on you. Shame. Shame. Go to your corner. Shame. 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 Go to your corner. Shame. Shame. I'm not even home yet, dude. Shame. Shame. There's double shame, shame. right there. Shame. Have y'all just been waiting in here? Like, I thought... Yes. Yes, we were just talking about shame. shame. We were talking yes. about things. Father. Guide us. Oh. I thought we were moving forward. Wait, where, when are we moving to? Where's your mother's house? Ha. <laughs> Brutal. <laughs> I'm probably going to be cutting in and out, but I guess we can just like... Wow! That's just see where we're going to pick up at.
Okay, uh, for serious stuff, we've just been talking about how bad the maps are. <laughs> Good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Complaints. And how bad chain guns are. Fuck. Do you guys have any suggestions? Personally, for me, I feel like it's actually better than the last iteration. It just oh, yeah, with less of those dark spots, it'd be excellent. Uh, so, also... your problem is the dark spots. It's the only negative about it I personally see. Aside from that, I think it's the best part of it yet. Yeah, best uh, variation. If we can remove Maybe. dark muscles, it should be good. We can um, remove I, dark muscles. Last time, I heard someone complaining about, a friend of mine, um, complaining about the fact that the at start, the innies would always stay in the ship because it's the most defensible and all their tools are immediately available. I, I, think, wouldn't, I would not be opposed to adding an orbital bombardment that targets the ship in a few, a few minutes after round start. That would be interesting. I just had a friend complain about that to me. I don't. I don't know if they want me to say the name or not. Maybe the ship would take off or something. I know during the last testing, there were some people that were asking, like they were here before our rebase. So there's good news. We do have units frigate map like in. It just still needs like a lot of work before that gets merged anytime soon. But it's there. Like, hopefully, we'll just try to, like, eventually, like, the goal is to have everything back. Is that fucking Duvaru Sandstorm in the distance? What the fuck? What? Yeah, I'm currently, see, I wasn't home because I'm supposed to be, like, DJing right now, but, you know, but I'm not. You're putting on Duvaru Sandstorm as a DJ? Well, that's not me. (laughs) (laughs) Gotta be right back. Goddamn. That's that's a pretty ancient meme. That's a nice right meme. Someone say something about memes. Oldie, but a good meme. Honestly, who doesn't love memes? Hold on, Noah. That's a bit uh gay. Uh nothing wrong with gay. Aggressively homosexual. <laughs> <laughs> what what? That's Noah. Some terrible typing. You know that. Noah. <laughs> I think Noah. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Noah, I think you're missing a chromosome. Are you okay, sir? It's fine. <laughs> it's okay. I hit my head on this dude's chandelier. <laughs> I heard, I heard very music. I heard good music. Hey, right, but uh, so let's see, map issues. Is there anything like any particular game mode you would you would you guys like to see before we go public alpha? I want to. Uh, I didn't know Kale. He was right uh, uh, covenant. Like something like a game mode, uh, covenant related game mode. Yeah, either yeah. like Covenant versus UNST or Covenant versus Covenant. Either war. I really. believe the roadmap has the Covenant as not being part of the Alpha. It's like after the Alpha. Yeah, so I think we're just focusing on Innies and UNSC. Then after the Alpha, we're focusing on Covenant. I think that's what we're doing. So, uh, poor Covenants. It's like we do have like the sprites there, they're just not coded in, and we don't really have any like enough assets for them. But we we're, played, we're getting on the be Genocide. We played one round on uh, Death Asteroid with the uh, Covenant, Covenant before. Yeah, that was uh, admin shenanigans to test the mobs because we're trying to get the uh, armor and stuff lined up to their sprites.
Their sprites are pretty big. Very. I like it. I mean, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Where are you? Are you in a club? Are you trying to do this and work at the same time? Hot damn. That's hustle. That's a mystery of hustle. I, I can do both. I gotta just step away. But that's why it's good to have a buddy. So I'm back to back so I can just step away. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> what the fuck is a hard sound rifle? It's a fucking gun. A fucking it's a dubstep made. gun. <laughs> yeah, human made sonic weapon originally intended for use in assassination missions against pol political leaders. Uh. This weapon usually causes damage by obliterating internal organs. Wowie. You, when are we uh, adding, when are we adding that? Causes. Uh, not acknowledge these war crimes. Quote, causes little noticeable external damage. Unquote. Yeah, fucking war crimes. That's what that is. Uh, yeah. Uh, I know you guys want... What more like detail with the factions? But uh, so basically, I got the idea from Escalations and how I want to be able to get it to work. I know we don't want to lock out players, but I feel like we should have an incentive. If they did join the factions, just have like extra roles just for them, like they can only do so. Because as you can tell, we did have a little like fuck around event today with some like cubbies and humans, and which was people enjoyed because you know it kind of had more of a. There was an RP thing around it, you know. It's kind of, they were sent to go scout out some shit. So we want to be able to have like certain players in these roles where, you know, we just don't want no random like gray type join joining and just like ruin the round for everybody, you know. Personally, think we should have some roles for like faction members, just more like uh, in depth, like only have certain people. Let's say just. Since I know the Covenant, like, they uh, voted in a Prophet, so that player will be whitelisted to just spawn in as a Prophet character, stuff like that. Because I know probably shouldn't be that hard to set up, you know, with the race whitelist, because, you know, most servers do it. I have an idea. That, so. I like you can that. only use the weapons if you're in a faction. No more grief. <laughs> and silence, of course. Should I got to go back to the stage. I was just so I haven't been noticing any problems with grief. Has there so been? You need to get whitelisted. Wait, Come back. you need to get whitelisted first to shoot a gun. Yes. What the fuck? Yeah, I don't. I personally don't really like that idea. I just realized I'm kidding, right? Oh, okay, okay. I, 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 I don't know sarcasm. I'm, I'm an autistic fuck. We're all autistic. We're playing Space Station 13. We're having a community meeting in Space Station about Space Station 13. What do you think we are? <laughs> I don't know. I was told to be here, so I am. Yeah, that's what I am. We're here to hear the, the community's voices, concerns, and ideas so we can, like, all work together. Because it's like, we want this server to be as fun for you guys as it is would be for any of us that are, you know, playing on stat, you know? You're expecting cooperation from Space Station 13 players? What is this heresy? That, that, I, know, that I, know, I know, I know, I know. That it's was a, my idea. I expect a lot out of you people. Great. And I'm a delusional fuck. Where is this thing? In this place, you must be mistaken, sir. If I can't gray tide other people, I don't know what I can do. Bingy bingy me one gray tide. I'm sorry, but uh, 
Stealing people's shoes is the funniest shit. <laughs> I, I did that one round in Goon as a chaplain. I was poor. Uh, so I just think my religion was about shoes. I stole everyone's shoes. Uh, At least try to. The, and the test server is going to be up more often since, you know, it just... It actually does help if players are on there just finding new bugs for us to fix and stuff like that. But I feel like our next public testing will probably might be after blocks finishes up with hostages, possibly. I don't, know, I, don't know, I don't know what the status is on that, so... Almost done, hopefully. I need to start testing sometime next week, so... So, uh, are we gonna be, like, forever, like, you don't need case link goes up, we're never gonna be, like, um, is, we're not gonna be, uh, what's, we're, we're not gonna be continually being up, right? Uh, I believe the plan is once we actually have other game modes it'll be up all the time, but I'm not entirely sure. Alright. Right now it's all about making it useful and testing. Like yeah. these, are, these are actual literal tests, so that's just what oh, this yeah. is. Yo, uh when are you gonna add a map changer so you don't have to recompile the code every time you wanna change maps? That likely won't happen until we get the final code in. So that's just something we're going to have to struggle with. We, don't have to we did have it. Gandalf. The Gandalf said he was going to look at it, but... I don't know how far he is on that. Um... Yes, unfortunately, I cannot force people to join the voice chat, so Wait, we on. can't ask. Gandalf's on your belt, <laughs> This we is, tried to Russell, it didn't work. Well, it sort of worked. Maybe if you say his name three times, it'll summon him. <laughs> Beetlejuice. God damn. Yeah. Um... Maybe it's to answer the person that just asked in text chat. What? They asked if we'd have janitors on the frigate. Janitors? Novelty rolls. Um, it it'll be considered, depending on our average uh, player rate, anyway. And, uh, well, for now, I need to head off. off. Uh, I have work in the morning. All right. Okay. Night. Okay. See. Well, we're saying in the morning, but it's 7 p.m., but it's a 12-hour shift, so I don't know what the heck's going to go ha happen. All righty, then. Yup. But, yeah, uh, the, the extra rolls has been considered, and there's still a lot of good ideas floating around about that. Well, yeah, apparently we have a ghost flood, uh, playbook flood now. Oh yeah, that was due to my blunder, but we tested it out and it, it works. So we you can, once you die, you can just re, you know, re-come back as a flood combat form. Nice. Huh. Wait, can, is it only like the, uh, Stranded, right? Yeah, it only works on Stranded. Okay, good. I don't want, I don't want to deal with flood of my insurrection. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> what? I heard the Mario one upset. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> okay, so, uh, oh, do not attempt to work and face bands at the same time. <laughs> can breathe. You okay there, Russell? 
I heard the Mario. I heard the Mario one of sound. That's what got me. Oh shit! Oh my god! You sound like a fucking nerd. How about that, idiot? Ha! Ha! Oh, I'm rapping. Oh ho ho! <laughs> what? That's racist. That's racist, sir. No, it's not racist. You can't. You can't say that around these ports. All right. All right, kids, calm down. Racism doesn't exist. It only exists because of society. So calm down, woman. Okay, guys. So we are going to Rickroll no Russell. Society. Ooh, I like that. Nice. Well, that has Cicero muted. Oh, shit. <laughs> Yo, when are we adding in the MOAs from uh, Russell, you there? Oh yeah, I want that smoke. Someone think possible. I think we should go with it. Oh, oh. crap! Oh, that didn't oh, work. Oh. This is this is the perfect. We should do this every time. We should do we should do this miss uh, meeting whenever Russell's at work. This is great. <laughs> what about them Gouda? And who, what, where? You know, the Gouda from Reach. Oh no, someone muted it. Oh no, Halo 1 and Halo 2. <laughs> who <laughs> took away Cicero's oh. voice? You monster. Was it Russell? He counteracted our Rick roll. The, uh. What's that about Halo 1 and Halo 2? Excuse me, sir? Excuse me. Excuse you? We're not we're Excuse not us. We're not doing this. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this like come on guys, this is our first recorded like well first recorded community meeting. This is it. <laughs> oh uh this is when great. are we gonna have uh animal genetics? When are we gonna have uh, diseases? Diseases. Uh, for the flood, I feel we probably get more detailed with it. Like what I'd like to see, you know, is like a slow progression of somebody like turning. That'd be great. Because originally it was like the human combat flood uh, flood sprite is just a combat. Uh, it's it's the overlay. Because originally uh -huh. we were planning on for players to be able to get infected and then change. Hey Russell, did you think about the only real disease that that works on our server is, um, the flood, the flood one. Except, and because I don't know, I, I don't think know people still get infections from when they dig the bullet drop and allow it with their fingers instead yeah, of letting but, an actual medic do it. Yeah, but the rounds are really short. Like, I think I think each insurrection round is like ten minutes. I've seen oh, people no, get could have, You could have yeah. flood spores, just like take the disease system from Bay. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. No, we have something planned for that. With. I need water. Oh, sword. Sword. So so bad. Like... Did you buff the sword? I did. I like. I mean, I changed the stats on it, but I'm not sure like how deadly it is. I'm. I only tried it once on one of the Marines, and it, it did, I mean, it blew off their lids and shit. Good. I was about to say it blew off their dick. Oh, my. Finally, I have a weapon to stab people with that actually is more effective than my pocket knife. I'll stab you. How about that, sir? I'm gonna stab myself. Haha. -ha. Shit. Oh, Jesus Christ, he's throwing yeah. down the sauce. What? What? Some strange DJ lingo there. 
He's throwing down the sauce, guys. The sauce. <laughs> <laughs> throwing down all the sauce. Man, yo, your girl doesn't got the sauce. No ketchup. All the sauce. sauce. The sauce. sauce. Boom. Yo, ga. Think it's great. Papa, ka, ka, ka. Skip it. Papa. I can't do that. For real. He should just put us on instead of the music and confuse the people. Oh! Camping. This is some top notch music. What the fuck? Is there someone clapping? No, that's a Zippo. Okay, that's someone clapping. <laughs> you know, this sort of reminds me of a special lead class. <laughs> oh yeah, Cubbies. I do because you are we still, have, we still have some weapons well, that are not coded in, but they will be. So, so new additions for them. Ooh, what kind of weapons? Oh yeah, does the needler make people explode yet? I mean, they used to, but then it stopped working. All right, question. Uh, how are you going to sort out the balance between unshielded Spartans versus shielded elites? Ooh. Um. Their armor should probably be more burn resistant than it is at the moment, so we'll have to look at that. Because law wise, they would not have actual shields when they come up against the Covenant for the first time. Yeah, I think what we decided is in that situation where that's going to happen, it's likely going to be Team Black, which would have shields. Team Black? Team Black would have shields, yes. Mostly because I think they were they were armored with the Mark Fives before anyone else. Uh, no, they had a Skunk Works version of the Mark IV. Oh, okay. Y'all are sitting here and talking about lore. I'm hearing the same here. Yeah, uh, yeah in like the uh, frigate game modes and stuff, if the Spartans are called, it's got to basically be the ERT, and it's going to be Team Black. Oh, are we going to be uh, doing? <laughs> Ship versus so ship. No, so there will be no possible custom Spartans. That is possible, but I'm not sure if that's in the normal game mode. We'll see. Okay. That would be for like PvP stuff for sure, though. Like, are we going to be doing um ship versus ship? Hopefully. It's like, like that. we do have. I, I mentioned earlier, we do have like the. UNSC frigate map, which that would be the first step to that, because that would mean start having our fun times of people crashing into the hangar again. For some yeah. of you guys, can remember that. And uh, the frigate map, if we get that running, we can start maybe doing extended uh, rounds, just running the server for people to mess around. Ooh. Ooh. See, in reality, I would another thing would be pretty cool to do once we have our overmap thing is have. All three factions on the overmap with their own separate ship and like own base or something. Some big game mode, who knows? That'd be cool. If you are one of the people who have a custom Spartan, all you would have to do is ask the admins to just swap it in for you. If I can, if I can get that old VIP code from my server to work again, it's like I basically it could use databases and it gives a donator their own little like PDA and it will just spawn them whatever item they their own personal item that they uh, requested. She give. And it does give the, the donators their own little chat on the server so they would get, like, V-save. Um, V-save is used by Bay now, just so you know. Donate should get uh, the slamming helmet things from Halo Reach. I think that's they had that. I may be remembering wrong.
I thought you had the VIP code already working. That's uh, another question. Was that sure. how will the hunter bonding system work? I imagine um, that would ha uh, be handled RP wise, but how would that actually affect the gameplay? Well, that would be up to the players to RP. We are uh, just mid RP, so. I think we might be able to code it so if one of them dies, the other gets a bit of a buff like they do in lore, but. Alright, this is kind of a shitty question, but what is your stance on like making this server do you like what are you specifically gunning for do we uh, like, like you repeat that you cut out a bit for me all right so what are you specifically going for in making this server the main uh, focus is getting the uh ship combat working for rp level what we've mainly just been going for is a uh, kind of medium rp you can rp lower stuff and it would be preferred but you don't have to it's not forced, not mandated. And yeah. the term I like to go for is RP encouraged, not enforced. Unless it don't. Then, I mean, I would think if it would depend on like the knob too. Like, you don't want to have your like baldy mid captain saying, you know what, let's go straight to the ash field and just sit there. Yeah, uh, some game modes will enforce some RP, but otherwise, you're free to do it how you see fit. As you don't do something incredibly stupid, like name your character John One One Seven, and then be uh, an assistant running around ramboing everyone. Of course, the advantage, the, Halo. the advantage of the faction system will also really be helping out for like stupid captains. Yeah, yeah. Right, factions right. can definitely be a deterrent for that because the people that are applying for factions are actually willing to put forth the effort to do a little bit more than the typical person that didn't, you know. Yeah, and eventually the whole rank thing that the factions have been doing in a thread sheet will be put in-game so that uh, players can actually earn an in-game rank. Alright, my last question. Can I be a Spartan named Mr. John Halo, and uh, he is the best Spartan that ever was? No, that is a terrible fanfiction, and you should feel bad. <laughs> we have a rule against that type of shenanigans. <laughs> I'm sorry, but you have to, you're going to be from a band now. Honestly, my favorite Spartan is Halo 3, honestly. Yeah. Like... Way better than Halo 2 or 1, honestly. You know, Spartan. Halo, Halo uh, what was Combat the one from uh, Legends? Uh... Spartan 1337. That guy's a fucking meme. Yeah. Halo Reach is one of the really good Spartans. What about Halo 5? Oh no, Halo 5 is a pretty freaking weak Spartan, you know, he needs three other Halos to keep him alive. Wowie. You know, Halo 4 is also pretty bad. You know, that's a, pr you know, Halo 4 is my least favorite character in the, uh... Halo universe. Yeah. I can't believe they killed off Halo ODST, though. Yeah, they killed off <laughs> Halo ODST. And replaced him with the Halo New Blood Spartan. I didn't really like him very much at all. Uh, yeah. Uh, that was Castle in space, right? I don't know. There's also the really. Fuck, I hated that book. Jesus Christ. <laughs> what the fuck? Any of you boys read uh, Broken Circle? Was that one good? Uh, whatever it was called. Uh, Generally, anything that 343 makes is gonna be shit. Uh, I don't think it was 343. Then it's probably good. Why isn't? But also, Bungie, Bungie probably doesn't care about it. Why doesn't Bungie make a Halo game? I don't want. I don't want Destiny. Stop whining. You're required to accept it. Yeah, Halo. Oh, see what all Bungie has done the past few years. Maybe three four three is a bit more competent than them. No. I lost faith in Bungie, but I've never had faith in 343. Too bad Bungie's making crap games now. Yep. Don't you guys love Destiny 2? 
with the um, right, transactions. Oh, uh, yeah. Halo Broken Circle takes place in uh, 851 BC for the first half. Oh, is that the weird one that explains the prophet's backstory? Yeah, it's actually pretty cool. I only read like half of it though, because I rented it out at a library. <laughs> So, do we have another thing with the uh, possible another thing we could do with factions once we have more players and they, you know they're all tight and all that, you know, well established. There we go. That's the word. <laughs> uh, we could possibly do like more extended, like uh, possible RP events or possible quote unquote campaigns, like Escalation kind of does. They have like certain uh, scenarios. Depending on how it ends, it affects the next play session. I call dibs on code, coding the Kobayashi Maru, but Halo. All right, I gotta say real quick uh, for a 343 thing, Halo Broken Circle actually looks pretty neat. Yeah. But generally, anything they make around the actual uh, post Halo 3 period kind of sucks ass. I'm surprised any of you nerds fucking read. Oh, I've read a lot of the Halo books. Actually, most of the books I've read have been Halo books. Not sure how to respond to that. I don't know. How... How do you respond to that, huh? I've literally read, uh, basically all the Halo books up to 2014. Excluding like all the freaking three for three crap. All right. Well, there's nothing else really going on. I'm gonna go ahead to bed. <gasps> wow. What? We. So okay, that was highly unpleasant. Please do not do it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're gonna have to perma ban you now. Sorry. Oh, oh crap. This is a trap. You're gonna be perma ban. Sorry. This is Chris Hansen. Have a yeah, seat. Uh, sorry? Sir. I gotta bring Have out my inner Canadian now. Have a seat. Okay, Have somebody connects this row. We need to test out the voice recognition. Hmm? No. Uh, we do Cicero, have another map. Play Woody's Got Wood. So... <laughs> Another thing we that's a major plus, we do have this big colony map, which was from the world server that has finally been ported over to Fargo. We just got to get it in proper, properly set up. And on that map, there's already like vehicles that are drivable because that was a code from them. They're like civilian vehicles, though. Was that the map uh, Cassie was working on? Yes. Oh, nice. Yo, uh... Yeah, it's how already does, done. Uh, how does Cicero work? It's a bot. What, what are you trying to do? Play some music. Uh, go to the hashtag music <laughs> channel and uh, go to mention it with the words music and then the uh, YouTube URL you want. Blocks, what have you done? Oh, don't worry. It starts in another channel and he doesn't have permission to move it into here. Oh, okay. That's good. Ah, uh, uh, that sucks. Idiot. You, was right. gonna, you were going yeah, so to play something like a meme, down, right? Too. You're not helping the situation at all. Oh, and somebody's muted the bot anyway, so... Stop James. hitting server mute on the bot. Hit James the muted it this time. I'm yeah, not going to unmute it. Yeah, move it over to general to... voice, please. Oh yeah, I'm not moving it. Somebody just muted it for everyone in every channel. Yeah, uh, move it in. Hey, no. Dolph, stop being a meme. Uh, nothing wrong with memes, honestly. Well, let's check what he's Except playing. Yours. Best of the Room by Connor Will... Connor uh, Wilshire. It's best of the movie, The Room. It should just I be a zero-second video, to be honest. It's a pretty good video, if I Considering do Considering that they're making a movie about how terrible they are at making movies, and made reference to that one. Alright, I'm off to bed. Alright. Yeah, okay.
Uh, yeah, it's been just short of an hour. Uh, anything else we need to take care of? Um, you uh, smell. Buff shotgun. Buff sword some more. Okay, anything that hasn't buff been already man. mentioned. Buff the fist. Excuse me? What? <laughs> buff punching, okay? So, uh, Spartans can like punch someone and their head explodes. That makes no sense. Like, none. Well, think about it. Like, fucking basically like 300 pounds of titanium going straight to your face. That wouldn't, uh, be too pleasant. I don't know. This is PlayStation 13. We've had people in this game mode already literally get shot in the heart, not have the organ, and manage to walk back to a doctor, ask for help, and then die. Nice. I once had my heart stop, and then I walked onto the pelican and escaped alive. Oh boy. Uh, yeah, maybe you should make it so you actually die when like one of your one of your vital organs just goes away. Otherwise, yeah. you wouldn't have those great moments, though. Yeah, but, like, the brain having to die for you to actually die is sort of dumb. You wouldn't have those great moments. If people moments, don't, like, uh, aim for the head, then basically no one dies. Dude. Make it yeah. at least so, like, That's if fun. you lose all the blood in your body, you die. Oh, I think if that happens, you do. The problem is you stop bleeding if your blood pressure gets too low, so everybody gets stuck with, like, a third of their blood left. Oh. Just remove that whole thing, honestly. Just bleed it until you're gone. My personal solution to that is, uh, in the game mode, if I have time, use the pistol and just blow their head off. Yeah, yeah that actually works. works. Yeah, beheading people's pretty fun. You know, just... <laughs> Cutting out their brain with a knife. Anyway, it's just it's a lot of fun to have those moments where, in normal term, in normal gameplay, you wouldn't survive. In real life, you wouldn't survive. But it's just fun, just uh, plain old okay. good fun. Okay. You know what Halo's built on? You know. Uh, yeah, it's also built on a lot of sweaty boys. Sweaty boys. You gotta say it with like, emphasis. And the battle rifle as well. Yeah, the battle rifle's pretty freaking sweaty. I make it an actual, like, thing where I don't use the battle rifle just for the pure fact that it's too good. Wow, I haven't seen this nerd in ages. Who just joined? Oh. oh. Did he just leave? That's Lemon Taco. Oh. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. It's gonna be. Alrighty yeah. then. Then go. Bye. Go I where your think, people need you. I think I've got to get going as well, yeah. so uh, that'll leave you with Russell. I'm not sure if he's even still here or busy working, but. We'll let you listen to music anyway. Bye. Goodbye. Russell, you smell. Russell, your game is crap. I mean, your code base. Oh, brutal. Got him. Russell, you're crap at coding. Yeah, got him, Russell, too. Your got profession him. is a joke. Brutal. I'm just gonna flip my uh, Zippo now. I need to find more tabletop things to do. Axis and allies is fun. Nah. 